Hi loves, it's your girl Tina and welcome back to my channel. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. And on this channel, we bring all that is positive with open arms. And for those of you who have been with me, hey, welcome back. I appreciate each and every one of you, my newbies and my OBs. So yes, I just want to tell you guys, thank you guys all so much. Please go ahead like subscribe comment down below hit the notification bell so you'll be able to see videos like this every week <laughs> and of course you can go ahead and follow me on all my social media platforms you already know the drill all right and again if you have any comments concerns opinions leave it in the description down i mean leave it in the comments down below okay so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video this video may be a little stretched out and all types of whatever but yeah and in today's video, of course, like the title says, right, and what you see in person, we are going to be going through my journey and my experience of doing my breast augmentation. So here it is. And mind you, yeah. So stay tuned to watch the whole entire video. And yes. And if you guys want to see my other video where I did uh, another surgery, you guys can go ahead and click the link right above and you guys let me know what you guys think. Leave it down below. Y'all know the drill. Okay, guys, without further ado, let's dive into today's video. Hope you guys all having a wonderful day. Hi loves, how are you guys all doing today? Okay, I know it's kind of dark right now, but um, I just wanted to come on here before the day ends to discuss um, about my breast augmentation. And of course, this is the process, or at least from my experience in my process. So uh, today it is September 9th and today it was just, it was a busy day for me. Um, because, well, went to work. As soon as I got home, I had to do, you know, run some errands. and Ended up going to Target, Costco, and all the other things. Anyways, I know you guys don't want to hear about that. But basically, um, so let's talk a little bit about today. So today, it is September 9th, 2020. And I have received a call, finally. It's an anesthesiologist. <laughs> Finally got the call from them today. And so we basically talked about, you know, like what I needed to do um, before my surgery day. Um, what I can and cannot do, so on and so forth. You know, like the rundown and everything. And so she called me while I was at work. So I'm basically working and talking to her at the same time, right? And so... She basically just told me, you know, and asked me questions about have I ever got anesthesia before, which I have. And if you guys haven't seen that video, you guys can go ahead and click up right above the link right above. And I'll show you to my other surgery that I have got gotten done last year. But that's a whole different story. But she talked to me about what I can and cannot do. And honestly, it kind of sucks because... Because during this during this pandemic, um, uh, my family members or anyone is not able to come with me into the hospital when I go and get my surgery done. Um, basically, what she told me was that they would have to drop me off. And when I'm done, they can come and pick me up. But basically... Um, I'd be in there by myself, basically, and so that's going to be kind of struggling. But other than that, I mean, yeah, I'm definitely going to be um, documenting documenting all of this. Um, but as far as I'm able to, because I am doing this by myself, so that's where it's just going to be kind of hard, I guess. But yeah, and so this is my process and my story of me finally having my breast augmentation and i want you guys to also understand that um you know this is something that i've been wanting to do for such a very long time i know we can go into you know feeling 
not the best and all of those things you know the norm but for me like oh wait let me make sure like these are covered before you know nothing is showing but for me like i have small titties you know what i mean and this whole thing has been a process and yes, as you can see, Savage X Fenty, come on down. <laughs> but anyways, like this whole thing is a process that I have been, that has been in the works for a while, since the beginning of this year. So as soon as I was done with my other surgery, um, we got into this already, like we scheduled my appointments and so on and so forth. So this whole entire year leading up until now, I've been seeing doctors, you know, going over some things and so on and so forth. And I'll get more into depth about it in my um in my next video. So in like my post op video maybe, I'll probably add that into it. I can show you like like my binder and like what I kind of put um put together for the doctor. And so yeah. So Anyways, like, I just wanted to come on here real quick and kind of talk about, about that. She called me. She asked me a lot of questions, you know, and it's, it's going to be a general anesthesia, just like the last time. Um, yeah, so I don't know what else more to say. I also have to take a COVID test and for my pre-op. I'm also going to have to see the doctor the day before my surgery. And so, yeah, it's, it's a lot. And I already have to do, like, my blood test that's, like, kind of somewhat due. But, you know, <laughs> that's something I'm doing tomorrow. But, yeah, you guys. So, I hope you guys enjoy the rest of today's video, you know, and my journey with me. Like, it's just, gosh, it's been long overdue and i'm just so excited about it like enjoy the rest of this video you know and yeah if you guys have any questions concerns or anything that you guys want to ask me please feel free to comment down below and you know if you want to like if you don't feel comfortable putting it out there you know in the world you know, if, or if you don't feel comfortable putting your questions or concerns down in the comments, you can always message me, okay? You can always message me somehow, even through, like, Instagram. Just DM me, you know. Um, you can also email me, but, you know, it's really your preference, you know. And I know in my post-op, we, like, like I said before, um... Or like I mentioned, we're going to go more into depth about the sizing and all of those extra, you know, things. Because I want it to be able, like, I want to make a video where I can actually sit down or, you know, and have a full-blown conversation about the sizing. If I went over, under the muscle, what type of breath or, or what type of bag did I go for, in other words. You know and so on and so far but this right here is this video right here it's just it's just the process of it like i guess leading from now leading up onto the surgery and then my next video my post that video will be um a week from my surgery day that's the video where i'm gonna be going more into depth about it you know, because I want to be able to give you the full, like my full experience after I have got the, the surgery. You know what I mean? And then we can talk more into depth about it and how I feel and what I actually went through and, you know, so on and so far. So as you can see here, oh, hold on. Don't want to get demonetized here. So let me just push this up. I don't want nothing showing. But this right here, oh my gosh. <laughs> of course, you guys, I am going to be documenting this whole entire process, okay? So have no fear, okay? But as you can see here, we are going to enjoy these last, these last week. 
or two from now with these size with these sizes so this right here is like a 34 B so whew. and of course like I mentioned check out Miss Savage X Fenty go ahead and cop you some <laughs> I hope you guys all enjoy today's video. Um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for your love and support. And yeah, thank you. And I'll see you in the next clip. <laughs> Hi, loves. So I just wanted to come on here real quick and just kind of let you guys know that I just got done with my flu shot right there. And I also just got done with my blood test, which is right here. So, yeah, I mean, I just want to come on here real quick and just, you know, check in with y'all. So, you guys, the next time we will see each other will be, I guess, when I go and do my COVID test for my surgery. So, yeah, until then, um, I'll see you guys. Well, on this clip pretty soon, but it's going to be more like in a week or two, a week and a half from now. So, yeah. This is where it's at. <laughs> this is the outcome. There's nobody nobody wants to get tested. That's it. you go. Oh, I wrong one. <laughs> yeah, I got you. Yeah, sure. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so soft, yeah. <laughs> You're fine. Um, yes. Date of birth. Jesus. There we go. You're fine. I know. I'm just being dramatic. <laughs> okay. Just a little uh, tickle. Have you had that before? No. Uh, I've seen a lot of people do it, like my friends and like their videos, and then you know. Which one? The one that just goes in, or the one that goes in in? In in. In girl, she going back here in. Okay, that's the one. Okay, well, you could have just surprised you me. Touch your you, know? brain. you could have just been like, <laughs> you're fine. And then, ha! Right, <laughs> just kidding. Right. No, I like to be honest. No, I'm not good. Thank you. Let me just. <laughs> She's like, let okay, me let just. Let me just <laughs> lean, lean with it. Oh, God. Pickle girl. Okay, you're ready. Mm hmm. Good job. You gotta okay, hold it up there for that long. Oh, <laughs> oh Jesus. <laughs> I gotta blow my nose now. Okay. One more? Yeah, this side. Oh, oh shit. Right. Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, Jesus. Alright, you can to see relaxed. There. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> We'll call you only if you have a positive. Okay. So as long as you don't hear from the doctor, that's. Well, at least I can breathe a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She cleaned your nose. God, she cleaned my nose. Go. I can breathe. <laughs> Alright, you guys. So I'm gonna be doing the same. Good morning, everyone. So today is September 22nd. It is the day before surgery. And it is about like seven o'clock in the morning. And as you can see here, I know I look a little shiny, but you know, I had my skincare on the night last night. So, so today I actually have an appointment with the doctor around 1 30. And so, oh, I literally just got up. So, I'm bear with me, okay? I'm not look crazy. But can we talk how, like, glowy my skin looks right now? She glowing. She just looks... Yeah. So, anyways, I just wanted to keep you guys posted. And... I'm so excited. So, nervous, but, like, I'm just so ready for it. So, yeah, I mean, let me just continue to get ready and get my life and wake up and all of this and all of that and i will see you guys real short well on this clip that is but girl i have like hours ahead of me from now and i just need a moment <laughs> to myself so yes 
I will see you guys shortly, okay? <laughs> okay, so basically my appointment is at 1.30 and I know I was kind of like rushing and kind of scattered, but from when I spoke to you guys early this morning, um, yeah, I had to do like more packing and I'm still moving, so there's a lot happening right now. But in the meantime, after I'm done here, I'm gonna go back to my other place, get those things ready and all that extra stuff. And yeah, but in the meantime, you guys, I'm gonna catch my breath, relax for a moment. And yeah, I'll let you guys know as soon as this is over, okay? So I'll see you guys in just a bit. Okay, so here we are. So, so far, I have to put this on, you know, and can we talk about all these bags right here? Oh my god, this is going to be in me. <laughs> and can we talk about this blue screen? Like, you know where they go and they draw it and stuff like that. I'm going to be standing here and taking my picture, so on and so far. And of course, we're going to put this in here because I want to see, like, <sighs> you guys, a lot's going on in my mind right now. So let me go ahead, put this on, and yeah. Much, much, much later. So yeah, I mean, that's that. So basically, I have until midnight where I cannot eat, I cannot drink, can't even chew gum, nothing. So, like, I don't even know what time it is. I don't even have my watch or any type of time on here. So, I'm, whatever. So, yeah, so I'm supposed to be at the hospital, like, by 5.30. And so, um, what you call them? So, I'm supposed to be at the hospital by 5.30 in the morning. And right now, I'm doing last minute whatever I have to do. So far, I think I'm all right. I think so. Let's just hope and pray that I am, okay? So, so as you can see here, I'm going to try and bring you down just to show you. Um, okay, I'm gonna try my best to like hide my nipples because I'm not about to get demonetized up in here. Okay, so hold on. So I'm gonna try and show you like, what it looks like after I got out of the shower because the doctor told me not to scrub it off. I don't know. So I think just to make it easier, yeah. <laughs> Hold up. Okay, so this is what I have so far. So I'm trying. <laughs> so I mean, I'm trying my best not to remove these scars i know i gained some weight right you know what oh well i know i gained. Know. oh what's going on back there oh she's swearing <laughs> you guys remember her from my last video <laughs> but yeah i mean oh my gosh i'm like i don't know like i'm nervous i'm ready and so so yeah, let me just go ahead and put this on. Oops. So let me just put this behind my ear. I know it looks like I don't I know it looks like I don't even have boobs, right? But you know what? All of that is about to change. So yeah, I know it looks a little crazy right now, but uh oh well. So here we go we're gonna go ahead and try this right now and another thing like the doctor um they also went ahead and gave me like instructions and you know what i need to do of course like what i need to do and stuff oh my god i forgot her name why am i forgetting her name but she is such a gem like she's so sweet she's been helping me it's like the doctor's assistant and like she has been such a dream. Like she's been helping me throughout this. And so she, thank you. Shout out to you. Let me go ahead and find out her name, okay? I don't want to be... Hold on. Shout out to Emmeline. That is um, the doctor's assistant. And she has been such a dream. Like she's been... <sighs> she's been helping me throughout this. So thank you, girl. I truly appreciate you. She's such a sweet, kind person, you know? I'm... Um, 
I've been, you know, she's been helping me through this, you know, so she's been booking me. Thank you. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, she has been like so sweet to me and I really appreciate that. And yeah, thank you. <laughs> Here. <laughs> there it is. Can you see that? That is what it's called. I don't know why I haven't done that the first freaking time, right? Oh, God. You see, like, that is on my mind right now. Like, so much is on my mind, especially tomorrow morning. So, like, yeah, my bad. So, this is what it's called. And as you can, I don't know if you can see the focus. But anyways, there's an ear right here. It goes behind the ear. But, yeah. So, let's go ahead and do this. Because you said to put this on before I go to bed. And so before I go to bed, I'm about to put this on and read the rest of the directions of what I need to do, you know, and so on and so forth. I remember the doctor saying that once you put this on, you have to basically wash your hands right after because you don't want to rub your eyes and, you know, your eyes get all puffy and big and stuff and, you know what I mean, and whatever the case may be. And we ain't about to experiment on that, okay? So we are about to just... They got next to a sink too, so that makes you know, so that makes it easier. So yes, caution: wash hands immediately after application. <laughs> yes, honey, I assist you. Oh, why not only you move this stuff? I want this stuff back here. No, I'm gonna go get carpet. Where is it? At the store. Where I never go to the store yet. Here. Okay. Oh, so yeah. So. Where did I always it? Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah. Anyways, really getting interrupted over here. Oh, so much noise. Excuse me, ma'am. <laughs> She's swearing. Del wasn't even washing your hands. I washed my hands. No, you did not. Ew. I'm gonna cut you out. <laughs> I'm gonna cut that. Hold up, come on, time to go to bed. It's my little puppy. She's... No, she's gonna sleep with me. Okay, you should have <laughs> I, got, I have to charge my phone with, I, I charge my phone with the freaking laptop. Oh, I'm looking at the iPhone 11. That's good. Okay, so here it is. It's just one, one tiny one. It doesn't matter what ear it goes through. <laughs> so it, it says that it doesn't matter left right doesn't matter do you you pick a ear so i'm gonna go with okay what side do i always sleep on kind of very so like, i'm gonna go with left okay what like okay it's one milligram for three days so like again i said earlier or if i didn't mention earlier this is to help girl this is to help the anesthesia because most cases you know after the anesthesia this you know kind of helps it because some people get you know nauseated and stuff so i'm trying to figure like great i have a freaking hair stuck on it how lovely yo i hope i'm doing this correct because i seriously do not want to frick like mess this up so down here, okay? So the whole entire ear, you don't want to go up here, down here. Like, you don't want to go up here or all the way over here. You want to go specifically around this area. So that's the bottom part right here. So you want to go down here. Because according to the picture, you want to go down to the lower part. Oh, God. I really don't want to mess this up. So... Okay, I want to make sure she is on. All right, you guys, so the next time you see me will be in the morning, the day of surgery. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. I'm so ready. I'm so pumped. I'm so scared, but I'm ready. So, yeah. All right, you guys, I'm going to get out of here. Good night, and I'll see you. Okay, so I'll see you guys in the morning. Early the next morning. Oh, goodness. It's the day of surgery.
Oh my god, could I stop it? Oh my goodness, here we go. Could I stop it? Oh my gosh. It is the day of surgery. So yeah, let me just go ahead, brush my teeth, wash my face, do the norm, and I'll see you guys when I get to the hospital. Oh my god, so here we are on our way to the hospital. <laughs> okay, well you know what? We'll see you guys in just a bit, okay? Bye. Okay, so here we are. We just arrived. I'm fucking so excited, bitch. So, yes, here we go. I know. Hello. Do I check in with you? I need you to take temperature. Oh, yeah. Where you want me to stay? Right here? I'll go back outside. Like, all the way down. Oh. Can I take your hat off? Thank you. There you go. Awesome. Yeah, right here. Thank you. Okay, guys, so here we go. We're about to. Oh, God. Do you guys remember here when I came down here the last time? Here we are. But this time it's. I'm by myself. So this is gonna suck. You have your phone in hand? Yes. What sign in she? Oh my gosh. It seems like high ghost city, but there's like nobody here. Look at that. Does anybody work here? More moments later. Much, much, much later. So we are in room number one. As you can see here, I had like a lot of apple juice and some more. Okay. And so, this right here keeps me warm, but I think I'm I'm warm. I'll try you guys like oh, I'm still so tired and so um, yeah so I'll, I'll see you guys in just a bit and we can talk a little bit more but right now I need to rest and get it together okay so we are now going down I'm, I'm being discharged from the hospital so here we go Hello. I'm sorry, I'm gonna take you downstairs. Okay, and I'll see you guys as soon as I get downstairs, okay? Okay, so here we go. We are back from the hospital. Well, first, what you call, we ended up going to get something to eat. So we went to Pandas, get some subways. And so here I am now. It took a moment for me to like move a lot because you know, I just got out of surgery, so I don't expect me to be doing the most, but here we go this is how it's looking so far this side as you can see it looks bigger than this side because well um hi she's swollen and yeah she she is swollen so we're gonna just show you like right here i don't i also don't want to get demonetized okay however this is a learning situation so so there it is. 
it does look small this side looks really like super big i just hope it gives me life yeah okay so here it is i think you can see the um this incision right there in the bottom so i got it in the bottom part and this looks so pretty like see it from the side angle and then we're gonna go from this angle. And yeah, we done. So as you can see here, she's literally stretching in the middle right there. So this is how it's looking. Okay, so I can barely even breathe, but oh my god. Ah! Ah! Oh, I felt that. Okay, so just want to say guys, thank you so much. And if you guys have any questions or concerns that you would like to ask me go ahead leave it in the comments below and i'll do my best to reach out to every single one of you if you want to know more and all of that okay but this part one is all about me going into surgery and you know the whole entire process of that alone so that's that and then my next video relating to this would be my post-op video so Stay tuned for that as well, okay? So I just want to tell you guys, thank you guys so much for being, you know, for being with me and, you know, riding along this train with me, supporting me and loving me. I truly appreciate each and every one of you guys. I really do. And yeah, I mean, I don't know what else to say other than like, I'm just so thankful that these things are happening. And yeah, I mean, what more can I say? <laughs>